won't mind if I search your bike now, would you? Go ahead. Get up. Calmate, gringo. Man, you guys even real cops. You look like the kids on Halloween. Why do you have... Oh, my God. Hey! Stop. What do I do? Chase someone! Chase someone? Are you leaving your bike here? Move, move. Don't run from me! You're making it worse for yourself! I'm gonna show you if you don't slow down, man! Come on! I'm not playing anymore! So not kidding! Oh my elbow. Schmidt, we got one! We got one, I got him! Yes! 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 Yeah! 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 people now! What up, bro? What's up? What up, What's bro? up? Welcome to Latin America. Thank you, sir. How you doing, Shane? Good, man. You? Fine, fine, fine. You wanna say, say hi to your aunt in Caracas? Oh, hey, how's it going? What's up, familia? <laughs> How did this story start in your careers? When did you decide to become in cops for this film? Honestly, I just started working on it five years ago. And, you know, I picked up this guy along the way and then we got to work and just had a blast. It was so fun. Yep. I don't know who you are. Don't worry about who I am. Oh, I'm worried about it. Why? Because you're in my party right now, dude. As a matter of fact, it's getting hot in here, huh? Oh, no, it's getting real. It's getting, it's real. getting very real. Yeah, it's like seven strangers living in one house. True story. You want real world? Yeah, let's do it, man. Come on. Here's real What's world. What's your real world? Hey, what do you think about this producer? Huh? Yeah, man. I, you know, I've, I've watched, I think, just about every one of his movies. I don't think I've missed yes. one. And I've always been a, just like a fan of his acting. And then I, it was no surprise to me that, that, you know, he started writing and producing. You know, the more and more I got to know about his career, and you know, he just called me up. I was I was really lucky enough for him to sort of bring me into the thing. Really, really, really lucky. And he's a producer, so we would produce each other's work. Yeah. Okay. So it was. Uh, he would produce, and I would executive. He would executive. He would put the executive part, and I would do the produ production yeah. part. Mm -hmm. Rule number one: the Jump Street. Bugazi. Do not get expelled. Nobody in the system knows you're here. All right, nobody. You get kicked out of school. Your monkey ass is getting kicked out of Jump Street. Rule number two, burns. Do not have sexual relations with students or teachers, sir. You hear that? That's you. Don't do it, man. Why you... Tell us about your responsibilities as a producer in this film. Honestly, it was just both of us were just trying to protect what we set out to make. And so try and put a bubble around. We want to make Bad Boys meets a John Hughes movie. And when you're a producer on the movies you act in, you can, you know, kind of create a protection so people don't try and change what you're trying to do. Yeah, because I think along the way of making a movie, you can, you kind of lose your way in a, in a, in a way. Sorry, I'm just so bored. No. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just kidding. Not with you. Damn, this guy. It's fine. I mean, he's always bored with me. He's always yawning. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so yeah, cool, cool. All right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No. I didn't know because he no, made a cool. face when I it's yawned, fun. and fun. I had to make a joke. It's fun. I'm so sorry, guys. I yawned. Jet lag. Jet lag. I'm so jet Or he's just being an asshole. One of the two. Uh, both. Yeah. It's probably <laughs> half and half. I right, take it here, so I know you're cool. Yeah. No, it's all good. Love doing just, drugs uh, at school. What's that? Barbecue Cool Ranch? You gotta pull the trigger. Okay, you gotta pull the trigger. What was the funny thing that happened to you shooting? Trying to not laugh during <laughs> this guy and Rob Riggle, he plays the coach. Um, that is, I, I just, I couldn't not do it. Like I had to find like a thing to look at off screen and just stare at it. When they would get on there, like their, their riffs, they would just play off each other. I couldn't take it. I, I physically could not be in the scene and not break. Schmitty? Schmitty? Phyllis. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll be right back, okay. dude. Hey, how are you? Oh, how is my favorite police officer? Okay. Now, your mother told me that you are undercover. Are you, are you undercover right now? Yes, and he's undercover right now. Shh. Oh, are those bad guys over there? Shh. Oh, God, this is so guys. Oh, my God. Oh, God, this is so exciting. I have got to call Annie. She is going to die. Shh. Shut, shut your fucking mouth. Shh. I what? have got shut to call Annie. Shut your fucking mouth. Understand me. 
What would you like to tell to our people in Latin America about 21 Jump Street? I think it's kind of a universal movie. You know, everybody likes to laugh and you want to see things, you know, that you can't see, you know, generally on, on an everyday uh, sort of basis. And I think we got a lot of that in this movie. You know, I think it takes a very unique approach to, to comedy and to something maybe you've seen before, if you have or if you haven't seen, uh, you know, the TV show. You know, it deals with, you know, everybody kind of grows up and has to sort of relive the things that they, you know, learned in the past. You forgot to read him his Miranda rights. Do you even know the Miranda rights? <laughs> Look, it obviously starts with, do you have the right to remain an attorney? Do you say you have the right to be an attorney? You do have the right to be an attorney if you want to. We're reviving a canceled undercover program from the 80s. Where do we report to? Down on Jump Street, 21 Jump Street. You are here because you some Justin Bieber, Miley Cyrus looking mothers. You will be going in as undercover high school students. You have exceptional muscle tone there, young man. When'd you go through puberty? Like it's seven or something? There's a new synthetic drug at Sagan High. The mission is find a supplier. I think the dealers are the popular kids. We should start a party. That would be the quickest way to get in with them. Come on, let's go. Don't give nobody no drugs, no alcohol. I promise you we'll be super professional. Take it here so I know you're cool. Have fun. Are you guys on drugs? I don't like that. Put your tongue back in your mouth. A lot of things that made me wonder about you. Your taste in music. The fact that you look like a 40-year-old man. Let me check out your chest. Check out your test. After what you pulled yesterday. There's no way you could be cuffed, right? Will you go to prom with me? Proximamente! Party! <laughs> 21 Jump Street! Why do you always jump across the car like that? Because it looks cool. You try. Un millón de gracias por acompañarnos hasta esta hora. Si quieren más información acerca de piratas, síguenos en Twitter, 35MM Online o Víctor X Original. O entren a nuestro Facebook, 35MM TV, y hagan clic en Me Gusta. También pueden pasar por nuestro blog, 35 milímetros. Está en Google. Nos vemos pronto y tendremos mucha más información acerca del cine desde Cancún o desde Hollywood.